Breaking news of a deadly shooting in Prague. Police there say several people are dead and dozens injured in a shooting near Prague University. New images from the scene show people running from the campus. Police now say the gunman is dead. ABC's Lama Hassan is live in London with more. Lama, what do we know at this point? Yeah, hey Diane, so this inform information is just coming into us. Here's what we know right now. There has been a shooting in the center of Prague at the Charles University in its Faculty of Philosophy. Police say that there are several dead and dozens injured. We don't have the exact numbers at this point, but what we do know is that the shooter, in the police's words, has been eliminated. But as you can imagine, there is a heavy police presence right now. There is video on, on social media showing people running away from the scene. The staff the university has been asked to lock themselves in their offices. The U.S. Embassy on X posting that there is an active shooter. The police reportedly have the situation contained, the Post says, but the area remains locked down, advising people to stay away. And just to give you an idea of where it is and how central it is, the shooting took place very close to the famous Charles Bridge, which is a major landmark in the Czech capital. Now, the whole of the square and the entire area surrounding the university is now locked down. We don't have any more information at this point uh, or any more details on the shooter uh, and what the motive could possibly be. It is also important to note at this point that this type of incident is rare in the Czech Republic. Gun crime is generally low. Diane. All right, ABC's Lama Hassan, thank you. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.